different research groups have been working since at least 2011 to see if they can measure brain activity in the visual cortex to assess what somebody is seeing in front of their eyes. In other words, if you're looking at a building, there's a different activity in your visual cortex than if you're looking at a puppy or a cup of coffee and so on. And so the research question is, can you tell what a person is seeing just by measuring the patterns in their visual cortex? And the answer is that you can pretty well tell what somebody is seeing this way. After that research came out, people realized we might be able to measure dreams because dreams are activity in the primary visual cortex. Dreams are experienced as visual because it's activity in the visual cortex. And your brain understands that as visual experience. So, Yukiyasu Kamatani and his colleagues published a paper a few years ago in which he took this same approach. He had people look at a bunch of pictures and watch a bunch of videos while they were in the brain scanner. And then he used machine learning to decode how the picture out there corresponds to the activity patterns in the brain. Now, you let people go to sleep in the scanner and you measure their visual cortex and you use the machine learning model to decode what that activity would correspond to. In other words, what they were presumably seeing in their dream. And once the machine learning model gives an answer, then you can make a little video reconstruction of their dream and you can watch what presumably was the experience for the dreamer.